What up, guys? Coming at you guys with another video. Here to talk about David Lemieux versus David Benavidez. Good fight. Um, third round stoppage for the Mexican monster, El Bandera Roja. David Benavidez gets the stoppage against David Lemieux. And if I'm being honest with you guys, I thought uh, the fight was over in the first round. Um, pretty much, really, the bell saved Lemieux. Uh, Darby, uh, Harvey Doc uh, pretty much said that, you know, he let it continue because of the bell. But, man, that was a good fight, man. David Benavidez gets the knockout, uh, makes a statement, keeps getting these uh, knockouts, keeps being in these title eliminators. I believe he's like the interim champ now. Um, but Lemieux, he had heart in there. You know, he was throwing bombs um, himself. David Benavidez, you know, Catching a lot of them using his uh, jab to stay at distance. Definitely that one who was working for him, uppercut. And like I said, once he, you guys already know, once David Benavidez sees, he kind of hurts you, buckled you. He's throwing these six, seven, eight piece combinations out of nowhere, you know, trying to get the ref to stop the fight. But nonetheless, uh, the corner pretty much uh, stopped the fight, you know. Lemieux was taking too much punishment. Good stoppage, in my opinion. It would have only been a matter of time uh, before David Benavidez really put some serious damage to Lemieux. But in Arizona, his hometown gets the dub. Shit, we got Charlo in what, like two or three weeks? That's a good fight. Caleb Plant, Canelo. Man, I'm, I'm still mad, man. As a boxing fan, we... Let's be honest, as boxing fans, we would have loved to seen Charlo uh, and Benavidez on that Canelo. Like if Canelo would have accepted that Showtime deal or Spence, as opposed to Bevel and Triple G. Let's be honest, let's just keep it 100, but that's already in the past. But let me know down in the comment section, who do you guys want to see David Benavidez fight next? Let me know.